Today's lesson is on writing research questions. In your LC, pages 274 to 275. Our objectives, review research report and write research questions. Now, in the previous lessons, we already tackled your research report, okay? So, let's have a review on this before writing research questions. Again, what is a research report? It is a systematic investigation of a topic and the study of materials and resources in order to establish facts and reach new conclusions. Now, some tips on uh, constructing research questions. When you write questions to pose to a panel, each question should be broad enough that each panel member can answer it thoughtfully and thoroughly. Questions should be interesting and thought-provoking and should engage the audience. Now, craft questions class connected to the topics of specific careers, personal and professional challenges and rewards, and the diversity and the workplace. Now, you can use these following words in your questions. Who, what, when, where, why, and how. Okay, let's try to fill in this table. Specific career and then questions on your right side, okay? Personal and professional challenges and rewards. Then diversity in the workplace. Next, specific career. Possible question, what is the most exciting part of working in your field? You use the clue, what? Next, personal and professional challenges and rewards. What possible research questions could you uh, construct here? It'd be, how important are rewards in terms of succeeding in your career? Next is diversity in the workplace. Possible question, why is diversity important in your field? Okay, so these are just some of the examples of uh, a topic, a broad topic, and a research question. Now, the questions you write should be specific and should not overlap. Important to know, what is a voice? Voice is defined as the writer's personality through his or her words, tone, and writing style. It also creates a sense that a real person is speaking to the reader and wants his or her message to be heard. Now, these are a few ways to incorporate a strong voice in your answer from a panel member. First is choose words and specialized terms that the panel member is likely to use. Use a tone such as funny, serious, or helpful that captures the panel member's personality. And lastly, write from the first person point of view using the pronoun I, me, and mine. That's all for today. Thank you for listening.